Hey, it's time to get critically speaking. Probably about the biggest movie opening this weekend. There have been 13, including this one, Halloween movies. From Season of the Witch to Halloween H2O, even Halloween Kills. Now, Halloween ends. And critically speaking, I don't think this movie uh, has to be good. It just needs Michael Myers. Hello. Hello. Michael Myers is back, and he eventually becomes as brutal as ever. Halloween Kills is said to be the last film in the franchise, as its most famous star finishes out the series. He killed my daughter, but tonight I will kill him. It's great to see Jamie Lee Curtis fighting once again as Laurie Strode, and the movie starts off strong. But then it starts doing what many horror films do. Here he goes, and then we're gonna his zip it best there. Director David Gordon Green is responsible for the last three Halloween movies. The first two have a solid premise that lead to a decent story that's easy to follow. However, about 15 minutes into Halloween Ends, it begins to jump too quickly through plot points and drop information in or leave details out that make it hard for an audience to invest in your characters. Set. Set. And action. And here's a biggie. They even change what I think is the nature of the main character in a way that goes against the entire franchise. I was certain that I saw him. But with all that said, this is a Halloween film with all of its suspenseful scariness. And the last 45 minutes has enough horrifying fun to let you know how Halloween ends. I got you in the mood, didn't it? Yeah, okay, it did. the middle 35 to 40 minutes of this movie are actually rough. Mm. Uh, rough as in not good? Uh, rough as in not good, yeah. Mm. <laughs> rough as in not good. But the end of the, the film, Halloween ends, uh, Michael Myers with ridiculous horror fun. And that's almost, it almost makes up for what's lacking. I give this film a C. And for me, that is a very mild thumbs up. I almost gave this bad boy a C minus. Ooh, um, Lee. Which is still a very mild thumbs up as well. well what's a but thumbs down then if a C minus is a thumbs up? This is Lee from high school grading when I got a C minus <laughs> and I went home to mom and said, I got a C minus, we made it, we made it. Okay. Uh, so if it's a D or a F, there you go. bonk, or if it's an E, which is you get out of here or expelled. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a C for me. And the middle 40, 40 minutes is, but the last 45, ridiculous. That's awesome. And fun. If you're a Halloween fan, you get what you want. At the end, you yeah. do get what you want. You and go. the first scene out the blocks, great. Ropes you in. Yeah. Ooh, I'm hooked. I although I and I heard some of the conversation yesterday. I've seen no Halloween. Mm, same. Oh. Ever. Well, just like Jay Tower said, the first one. 2018. 78. And 18. then if you like those two, keep going. If if not. Keep Go going from 2018 and on. Yeah, just okay. from 2018, 2020, and then this film. Okay. You don't have you watch four movies instead of you know yeah. 13. <laughs> <laughs> I like that plan.